Hey there and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be our BoxyCharm unboxing. I have here my BoxyCharm for the month of January that we'll be sharing with you guys in today's video. I'm gonna share all of the products, we'll do swatches, so if that sounds good, why don't we go ahead and get started. All right, so I have here our BoxyCharm for the month of January. This is our first box of the year, so I have high hopes on what is inside. I haven't looked at it yet, so you guys can actually sign up for BoxyCharm. I'll have my link down in the description box. It is a monthly subscription service that is $25 a month. You receive five to six full-size items every single month, and I believe the value of the box is supposed to be at about $150, and we always typically have some pretty good products, so I'm excited to see what we did get this month in our box. So why don't we go ahead and open it up so we can find out. So the theme this month is Breaking the Ice. Here is what the card looks like. It looks like I got variation number two. You guys always ask me uh, which variation I got. It has that little two in the corner. So I got number two. The first item in here is from Wonder Beauty. This is a brand that I do really, really like. This is the Trip for Two Blush and Bronzer Duo. Here is the packaging on that one. Really pretty nude packaging. I know I have one of these in my collection. I'm not not sure which one this one is. There are two different face palettes. There's like a deeper one and a lighter one. So here is the packaging here. Again, super cute. My camera doesn't want to focus. There we go. Here is the inside of the palette. So you do get a blush shade as well as a bronzer shade. It also has a really nice mirror on it as well. I'll go ahead and swatch both of the shades. This is a really buttery formula. Like I said, I do have the other palette and I really like it. I will say that it's a pretty pigmented palette. So a little bit goes a long way with these products but here is a swatch of both of those shades the bronzer on me probably would be a little dark I think that's why I kept the lighter palette when I was sent these but I do think that it is a really great formula like I said and the price on this one is $36 for the duo the next product I see in here is from grande and this is their grande drama intense thickening mascara with castor oil I actually own this one as well and I do really like this product the the price on this one here is $25, so it's a little bit of a pricey mascara. I went ahead and pulled out the one that I do have so I can show you guys the wand on it. It's definitely a mascara that gives you a nice, like, coated, thick look on your lashes. So if you enjoy thick lashes, um, you're definitely going to like this one. I personally didn't notice, like, too, too much with the lengthening on this. I feel like it did a good job of lengthening them but I don't think it was like my favorite formula I've ever tried, but here is the wand on there. It's a really nice wand, and you do get quite a bit of product in here. I feel like there's more than, I don't know why, but I feel like there's more than there is in like a normal mascara. Maybe it's just because the tube is so big here, but this is a good one here from Grande. Again, the price on that one was $25. And then next up in here, we have a skincare product, and this is from Glow Recipe. I've really been enjoying getting into their products lately, so go ahead and open this one up. This one is going Going to be their watermelon glow sleeping mask I personally have not tried this but I've heard amazing things about it I feel like people rave about this all the time I want to say Jaclyn Hill like raved about it back in the day and I know anything she raves about when it comes to skincare everyone is like I need it um, but this is a sleeping mask I'm gonna go ahead and pull off this little cover right here it just comes in this really cute like glass bottle and this is a watermelon mask so I'm assuming it's gonna have a watermelon scent to it so it does definitely smell like watermelon. It kind of has a bit of an intense smell. I'll go ahead and take a little out so I can show you guys the consistency. Ooh, it actually feels like pretty thick. It's almost like sticky in a way. Here's a little bit of it on my hand and I'll show you guys. It almost feels, I don't know, like a jelly type formula. But here is what it looks like if you blend it out. So again, this is just going to be a sleeping mask. You're going to apply this one at night. It does have a strong scent to it. So if a uh, like sense is something that bothers your skin or you have sensitivity, I don't know how this will work with it, but I have, like I said, heard amazing things about this and it is a nice size jar of it. So this is something you're going to apply at night and it says that it'll work while you're sleeping to gently exfoliate and clarify your skin to leave it more radiant. So definitely excited about that one. I'll probably give it a try tonight and see how it works on my skin, but it just smells really good. I love the smell of watermelon. The price on the sleeping mask is $22 for this one. And then we have our palette for this month in my box. This is the Ace Butte Scarlet Dusk Palette. 
Ace Butte, I think I'm saying that. I don't remember how to exactly pronounce this. I know we've gotten stuff from them in the past. So again, the palette that I got is the Scarlet Dusk palette. It does seem like a pretty good size, really cute packaging. It has like these like rose gold detail there with the black. Ooh, this is pretty. And here is the inside. This is actually really nice. I love the color selection because it's like a neutral palette, but it also has some vibrant pops in here. I like this. Actually, I wouldn't consider this a neutral palette, actually. I was thinking it does look neutral, but I don't think it really does. Like, maybe the shade Lotus does, but it's pretty much just like an orangey, very bright, like, mauve toned palette. I think that this is super gorgeous. It does have a mirror. I'm going to go ahead and swatch all the shades so I can show them to you. Uh, so far, the mattes actually are swatching nicely on my finger here, so we'll see how they swatch on my hand. All right, so here are the swatches of all 12 of the shades from the palette. So we do have four different shimmer shades and then the rest are mattes. I do think that the shimmers in here both are pretty similar. I kind of swatched them right next to each other. I feel like they kind of really look like the same shade, but I am excited to try this out on the eyes. They all swatched really nicely. And again, I love the tones of this. It's kind of like a berry orangey palette. This one was the Scarlet Dusk. I think there was one other palette when I was seeing uh, the different palettes you could get. I think there's two different variations of these, but I really like this color story of this one. And then we have one last product in here. I forgot to say how much that costs. So it's $34.99 for the palette. And then we have the last product in here, which is from Too Faced. And this is one of their Diamond Fire Highlighters. I love the packaging on these. I think they are so cute. So this one here that I have is the shade Canary Diamond. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the shade right here. I actually own this in my collection already. But here is what it looks like. The price on this one is $36. I love the packaging on these. I think they are so cute. They kind of remind me of just like a treasure chest with like the little clasp there. They just have a magnetic close. But here is that shade right here. I'll go ahead and swatch it for you guys. This one's more of like a like iridescent gold shade and it is really pretty on the skin. I do really like this formula. Here is what it looks like. This one is a little bit deep for me, but I can definitely use it. I just use it more as like a bronzer topper as opposed to like a highlight. They are a little bit glittery, but they're not too glittery. You can definitely build these up or they can be a little bit more sheer on the skin. So there is kind of blended out right there. You can see, I think these are really pretty highlights. I love the fact that we got a Too Faced product in here. I feel like we don't get stuff from them very often in our BoxyCharm, so that is exciting. So again, that one was $36. So that is everything that I did get inside of my box. So to run through everything, we got the highlights from Too Faced. We got the full 12 pan eyeshadow palette here from Ace Beauté. We also got the Grande mascara in here. We got the sleeping mask. And then I also got the Trip for Two bronzer and blush duo. So I definitely think this is a good box this month. Again, it's $25. That is the cost of one of these products alone. So I'll go ahead and add up the total price of my box so we can see the value in it. So the value of my box is $153.99, so $154 for my box. So if you end up getting this variation, I definitely think you are getting your money's worth. It's only $25 for the subscription. I really like all the products that we got. I love that I was able to kind of attest to a few of them as well, let you guys know about the formula. You'll have to comment down below what you got inside of your BoxyCharm. Again, I'll have the link to sign up for it down in the description box if you are interested. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, friends.